folks. I made her. <laughs> I'm at the Kawartha Downs racetrack, tractor pull. I just got here. It was about a two, uh, just just under two and a half hour drive. Uh, I'm just gonna go over there and get in line. There's a bit of a line going through the gate here. It starts at six o'clock. It's uh, it's uh, five o'clock, a little after five, I think. First time I've been here. It rained on the way here a bit, uh, but it's supposed to be okay, I guess, for the tractor pull. The sky's kind of cleared up, so I'm gonna head over there right now. And we'll see you over at the track. Okay. Okay, folks, I made her back through here. Here's, uh, I had to go through that line right there. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of like a tunnel. My truck's on the other side. So I'm here, finally. It took about 20 minutes to go through that line. Uh, working up the track there. This is a pretty cool place. It's, they have like harness racing right here. So we're probably like, uh, I think it's like 13 kilometers south of Peterborough. Kind of hard to hear with this big tractor here working up the track, but we'll go have a look and see. Pretty interesting. So there's a over there. I'm going to zoom in. Is where they do the. There's like a restaurant and whatever. And they do the uh, the harness track racing, horse racing. They just put this track in a couple years ago. It's supposed to be one of the best pulling tracks in Ontario. I don't know if you can get into the pits or not. I'm going to see. Probably not allowed to, but we'll go check out the pits if we're allowed to go through there. Might have to go to the other side, maybe. <clears throat> okay, we're getting ready to go here. Got a pretty good crowd. Both sides of the track. We get the sled ready here. The executioner. We're going to have... Uh, some really good classes here tonight. We got the hot stock four wheel drives, the super stock four wheel drives, the super modified four wheel drives, uh, the pro stocks, the modified farm, and the modified two wheel drive trucks. They got a pretty good track here, other than it's kind of has a few rocks in it. And if you look down there, right there, I don't know if you can see that, there's a bit of a mud hole. Kind of wet right there. Okay, well, stay tuned here. We're gonna get underway here in a minute. This awesome video is brought to you by Big J's Beans, the logger's choice. Here we go.
fire in the hole. Now what do you think of that folks? Some go and some blow here. We got a Ford. Now they got it out. Yeah, alrighty, everybody's okay. Yeah. Wish I had some hot dogs. I'd cook up some hot dogs on there. Big J special. Okay guys, coming to the end here, we got the two-wheel drive class coming up. Uh, this track is just absolutely terrible tonight. Uh, they got a quite a bit of rain here this afternoon, but it's not really the rain is the problem. Underneath the track, there is drainage pipes. Apparently to drain the track if it rains, but apparently they figure some of the pipes in the track got busted. And there's a sump pump down there that's not working or something. I'm not really sure what's going on, but it's probably like, as you can see, the tractor that's great in the track is even having trouble getting through here. There's actually water. There's water bubbling up on the middle of the track here so the guys can't get any traction at all really some of the trucks made it to the end but uh, yeah they're uh, touting this as one of the best tracks in Ontario well not tonight I disagree unfortunate I'll drive two and a half hours to see a pole that's got a really bad track Okay guys, stay tuned for the two-wheel drive trucks. Okay, these are the two-wheel drive trucks. They are really, really loud. No 
over uh, 2,500 horsepower right here. Getting them hooked up here. Okay, I'm going to step back here a little bit.
Hey folks, logger John back here and I'm literally like maybe less than 10 minutes from my house. I've been driving for well over two hours. It's uh, 10 minutes to one in the morning. <laughs> Heading home from the tractor pull. Uh, it was a good drive coming home. Traffic was really, really light going up the traffic was pretty heavy in the afternoon there hit some rain but a uh, little bit disappointed as you can tell by the video the uh, the pulling track was uh, pretty much uh, bad. it was really bad um, don't know what to say um, well we got a bump here hold on oh dear that bump's been there by the way for two years and they haven't fixed it but anyways uh, yeah so I hope you kind of enjoyed that uh, it was a long ways to go for such a poor track they had definitely had some water issues um, they put the track in a couple years ago and they said it was they Flaunted it as the best pulling track in Ontario, but uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> they put some drainage underneath and it didn't work. It had rain there this afternoon a bit and the drain... What I think would happen is what they were talking about was uh, the guy that was working up the track there at the beginning with that big tractor. I'm wondering if he hit some pipes underneath or something. That's what they're thinking. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. I've been to some really good poles over the years, and I've been to some pretty bad poles. That's probably, like, probably one of the worst. You know, kind of disappointing because you drive for two and a half hours thinking you're going to see a really good show. And it's too bad they had a big crowd there and everything. It's a beautiful facility, but yeah. Anyways, um, yeah, so that's the first tractor pull I went to. Hopefully they get a little bit better as we go here. Um, I have one in a few weeks to go to, and uh, we'll see how that goes. And uh, okay guys, well thanks a lot for watching. I'm going to be home in a few minutes here, and oh, I'm going to miss my turn here if I'm not careful. <laughs> Anyways, thanks a lot for watching, guys, and uh, I'm heading home a few minutes away, and I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> Might not be too early in the morning tomorrow. Tomorrow's Sunday. I'm going to post a video tomorrow. And yeah, which you'll see, you'll see tomorrow, but you won't see this video until next week or whatever. So, okay, guys, now I, I know I'm back home because I'm on a gravel road now. <laughs> Almost home. Over and out, guys. Four, 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 four.